Hey, I'm Mark Call. Hey, I'm Mark Call. I might have repeated myself. Um, I just wanted to answer your question. You typed in, what is a VQ scan for lungs? Uh, it's a nuclear medicine procedure. I'm a retired nuclear medicine technologist with over 23 years of experience. But I wanted to explain to you what the procedure is, kind of on a layman's terms, uh, make it a little easier to understand. Uh, it's a ventilation and perfusion study. The ventilation portion evaluates uh, airflow going in and out of the lungs. The perfusion part or quantification part uh, evaluates blood flow to the lungs. And I could get all into the radiopharmaceuticals that uh, it takes to do it and the imaging pro protocol, but basically it's just an evaluation for pulmonary embolism or a blood clot in the lungs. There are other things that it's used for uh, evaluating as to whether a patient can have part of a lung removed and uh, uh, survive without any problems. Uh, the, the rest of the lungs that are left would be able to support the patient. But that's what it is. Uh, pretty simple procedure. Ventilation, you breathe in and out an aerosol or a gas and then they take pictures. It takes about 15 minutes. Uh, perfusion or quantification portion of the test. Uh, you get the injection in the vein in your arm. Uh, the radioactive protein goes in and localizes on the, in, on, according to blood flow. If you have good blood flow everywhere, you get a good paint job everywhere. Uh, if you uh, have a blockage or something stopping the blood flow, well, it shows up as a missing area on a lung. And uh, that's all about uh, nuclear medicine VQ lung scans. I'm Mark Call. You have a great day.